How are we doing folks? Right, so this is a crazy video for you. This is how to apply oils and potions to the beard. Now, oil and beard balm. So the brands I'm going to be using today is this brand. If we can get that into focus folks. The Honest Amish. Right, so we start off with the old, uh, get the old um, knots in it out folks. I'll just add a bath, it's best to do it after a bath. Lovely beard, look at that. Mm. Get all the knots out. So the beard's still damp. Still slightly damp, folks. Look at that. And what we're going to do... Oh, that's nice, that. Now, apparently there's a thing called beard fork, where mine does it, it grows like that then you've got a fork in the beard um, I always thought it was just my beard, I thought it was just saying I'll cut it wrong or something like that but basically it is, it's called fork beard like a viking so uh, we've got the oils folks, check this oil out Honest Amish can't go wrong with them, they're very expensive but I love them the Honest, honest Amish so we're uh, Put some of that on the old hands. You can't see what I'm doing. I'm just gonna take some out. Whoops! Drop some. Probably about five drops, because it depends on the length of the old beard, folks. Then it. So there's five drops on there. You can see that. So let's rub it in like that. <clears throat> Make the old hands nice and greasy, folks. Cool. It smells good as well. It's got a nice scent to uh, honest Amish. You can get it in the beard, folks. Oh yeah, it's nice, nice smell. Don't forget the old tash. Mm. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use a comb that's uh, got boar's bristles on it. Those things, so it's going to get through the beard basically. And we're going to try and get all the oil distributed throughout the beard folks it makes the beard look fuller as well ever since I started doing this it's, it's you know, grown a lot better because I never used to bother with it, let's face it folks, it did look like a mess didn't it but now I've started doing this it um, actually looks massive Super long. Right, so we got that. That's that done. So we've got the oils done, folks. Put the potions back. Now, this is a beard balm. Heavy duty. Sometimes you need heavy duty, folks. Come on, let's face it. But this is the Honest Amish as well. This, if you got this, if you got this online, this tin, four ounce tin, will cost probably about 50 cent quid. It's mad, isn't it? It's absolutely mad. But you can get smaller tins, two ounce tins on Amazon for like, I don't know, what is it, for 25 quid, something like that. But uh, these are from America, American made. Uh, it's all natural ingredients, folks. And um, yeah, this is the first time I'm actually using the balm. So let's give it a go. It's quite funny, if you look at the American website, Honest Amish, it's shut down at the moment, they're not doing international sales because of the thing that we can't speak about, folks. But, um, there you go, that's what it looks like, colour-wise. So, what, what do we do here? What do we do? Um, basically, just get a, a nail, carve a little, oh, that's nice, groove. Just about that much, don't want to use too much. And then you put that on your hand like that, folks. And then you rub it. You're doing it the same as you've done with the oil, basically. No, see? And then you pass that through the beard. Oh, it smells lovely. Mm. Nice. 
Get it all in there, folks. All into the beard. Look at that. Mm. Some people don't brush after they've done this. They just let it with the hair. Do it with the hands like that. Just let the hair go down. But it won't hurt it. Look at the size of that beard. It won't hurt it at all. I've always liked the bushy beards, folks. I'm not, you know, people whinging about it's um, it's not very uh, thingy, but it's how I want it. If I want advice, I'll go and see a barber's, folks. Some people, eh? Right. And you can, you can get the pick thing and go through it again, just to get out the. Won't hurt it. Use a wooden one, not a plastic one. Plastic. Tendency to rip the hairs more than wood. Been reading up about it a lot. So we've done that, and then core, cool, yeah. And the scent you get off the honest Amish. I mean, it's mad, folks. So is the beard getting longer, folks? Thanks very much for watching. Um, so the Honest Amish, folks. Check them out. They're expensive product, but it's a good product. None of this stuff has been used on animal testing, nothing like that. None of it's been tested on animals, so that's bloody brilliant. I'm an animal lover, folks. What can I say? Right, so thanks very much for watching, folks. Absolutely crazy. Hope you enjoyed that. Check out Instagram, Facebook, and all that jazz. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Folks, folks, folks. What should I say?